Hi, this is PD at Bergzerg Arcade at bergzergarcade.com, and today we're going to create our skill class. So let's go ahead and open up our project in Model Development, or sorry, Unity, and we'll go over to our Character Class folder, Create, C Sharp Script, and we'll just call it Skill. Double click to open up Model Development. It's going to be inheriting from modified stat, so we'll set that up. Get rid of the using statements, and we don't need the functions that come with it from Unity. Now this is going to be just as simple as it was to create our vital class. There's only one variable that it, we have to add, and that's going to be the known variable. So we're, it's going to be a type bool, so we'll just do private bool underscore known. Now all this variable does is just tell our, our game whether or not the character actually knows this skill. So if we have, let's say, 40 skills in the game, maybe the player starts off with 30 or so, or even just 10, and it allows him to be able to learn more skills as he goes along. So he, he might be able to purchase these skills, learn them from tomes, talk to trainers. Whatever way you want your character to learn these skills, we'll be able to implement that a little later on. So let's build our default constructor. So it's a public. And we'll just want to set the known variable. Uh, we'll set it to equal false to start. So all skills when, he f when the game first starts, he won't know. And let's also, again, go ahead and set the experience to level to some value other than the default. I'm going to make my skills really cheap to start off with. And then give them a level modifier of 1.1 and make sure it's a float. So this class really just needs a basic setter and getter. It's going to return a bool. And then let's create the enumeration of skills. So it's going to be a public enum skill name, then a list of all the skills that you want. So mine's going to be fairly simple at least to start with, and I can just add more skills later on as I as I want to implement them. So we're going to start off with the melee underscore offense. And of course, we'll want to melee defense. We'll create a ranged offense, ranged defense. And a magic. I'll just do those six for now. Now these can be broken down even more. So instead of having something like melee offense, you could have a skill that like axe, uh, sword, mace. You know, you, you could actually break these up and have a proficiency for each type of weapon. I'm just going to keep it simple now and just group all melee weapons under the same skill, all ranged weapons under the same skill, and all magic types under the same skill. And that's pretty much all we need for our. Uh, we didn't set the name of our skill, our class, to skill. Uh, quickly go over to Unity, make sure there's no errors. We do have one. And we didn't set it to equal value. Okay, no errors. So there we go, we have our skill class made.
In our next video, we'll implement the basic character class that we can use to inherit from to create our player characters as well as the mobs that we're going to be fighting. So I'll see you then. Bye-bye.